we will first remove the three mounting screws from the water pump. Please note that there is one that's longer. That would be the one on the bottom. You will wiggle the water pump and pull on it and it will come off the engine. You don't have to drain the cooling system to do clutch maintenance. The water pump seals to the engine with a no-ring here. The new style water pump starting in 2015 has a Allen screw for a drain. The old one, the drain was a bronze bushing in the center. I call this a cassette type because you just change out an interior in one unit that's considered not repairable. You have your external housing which is threaded and then you have the, the silver looking part there that's the, the cassette piece that goes in. This is a common spanner. This is a bicycle tool, but sometimes you'll have a universal spanner that has different size interchangeable tips for the diameters of the holes. But you just put it in the two little holes there and counterclockwise it comes loose and then you just spin it out of the housing and, and take it off. And you have your new one ready to go. That's how it comes complete. It even has the O-ring on it that seals it to the housing. And you inspect the housing and make sure it's nice and clean inside. This is what the replacement unit looks like. It's all ready to go. Inside the housing is a little bronze or copper bushing right in the center. I don't know if it's replaceable or not. I didn't find a part number for it. But I think it should last a very long time. Put my light in there so you can see it right in the middle. So I put it in a soft jaw and it just goes right in clockwise and snug it up not too tight with your spanner wrench and you're ready to go. That's what it looks like all finished. Thank you for watching my videos.